Hello, here's your beautiful Waltham and uh, with its private label on it. It's gorgeous, gorgeous style, gorgeous watch on its way to Germany. So this is really cool. I think it's the first one I've sent to Germany. Quite a few other places, but not Germany. So let's start with the <coughs> care. It's not a waterproof watch, so you don't want to wear it in the rain, when it's raining, when it's wet, when there's droplets, uh, anything like that in the house. If you're going to do the dishes, I take mine off. Uh, that's important. And other than that, it's a wear every day watch and, uh, it's beautiful. So let's start with the winding. And, uh, so when I, this is how we wind these. So you're going to do a slight pressure in and only in the forward direction, not back and forth like a modern watch. Okay. Not like that. Not like that. Just forward and slight pressure in and until we get a full wind, um, so I'm bringing it close so you can kind of hear it in forward direction until it stops. And you'll know when it stops because you cannot wind it. And if, unless you're Hulk Hogan, you're not going to break the mainspring. It's important that you get a full wind so it keeps the right time. And this thing is running excellent. And I hope that it is doing the same thing it's supposed to do when it gets to Germany. So what I'm going to tell you is I just wound it. And if you notice... The second hand down here is ticking. Now, if you get this and you wind it full and it uh, it's not doing this, don't panic because it's had a long trip and the hair springs on the balance wheel get a little uh, testy um, with all the flight and uh, what do they call those things? Scanners at the airport, that kind of junk. So um, if you get it and it's not ticking, okay, do a little like uh, coffee swirl like that. Do a little swirl. Okay, just bloop, like that. Uh, kind of like if you were reading uh, the tea leaves after you, <coughs> uh, in your tea, when you poured it out, you're kind of kind of looking at the bottom and kind of swiveling just a little bit, and that should get it running. Uh, I don't think you're going to have a problem. I don't want to ship a watch to Germany if you're going to have a problem, but I'm just saying that just, just in case that's a, um, how you can solve that problem. And uh, there you go. So, uh, setting the time now, we want to do, instead of a pull on the crown like this, we want to have a little more control on the crown. So, you're going to do a pinch behind the crown. Okay, you can hear the click. I'll push it back in. This is such a different setup than the m more modern watches. It's like a, exactly like a pocket watch. So, I'll push it back in one more time. So, a pinch on the crown, pull it out. And then when you set the time, do it in the forward direction or clockwise. forward clockwise forward and just take your time it's uh something you'll get used to and experience and it's a beautiful thing okay so there we go now one more thing i'm going to show you here when you've had it and you've worn it for a while you might want to invest in something that, uh, i guess you could buy amazon anything get a rouge rouge clock you can spell it r-o-u-g-e and uh, on the gold fill right here it gets a little dull after you use it so let's see if I can do this. So you just get a rouge cloth. Mine's pretty old. And the little rouge powder and keep it away from the back of the band. Just on the front, on the glass, on everything. You get your fingerprints on it, just takes it off. And on the side. Just a light buff. And it'll take all your fingerprints off the back. All of mine that I just put on this morning. And there you go. And after you do that, just get yourself a clean cloth. And just, you can see already from me doing that, that it's just, it's beautiful. Like I say, try to keep your, keep it off the band, back of the band, because it's, well, here we go. Yeah. Hard to do this through the own. Anyway, there you go. That keeps everything just, like I say, as much as you wear it, you can tell when it starts to dull up, just a little rouge cloth on there. And away you go. And uh, beautiful watch. And I, I thank you for giving her a new home in Germany. And uh, again, thank you.